we just crossed the uh, Bay Bridge because Will Marie wanted to do one last very special Maryland thing before we head back. What, what did you want to do, baby? I want to eat crabs. She wants to eat Maryland blue crabs. So we're going to head to our favorite spot right across the Bay Bridge. What was the name of it again? Harry's Crab House, I think. Harry's Crab House. Highly recommended kitten arrows real close to the bridge. I love doing this every summer. One of my favorite things to do. Oh yeah, we make a we make a point to come down here at least maybe once or twice a summer. Uh, whenever we can beat out the crowds because it's usually pretty packed. You know, it's Maryland. There's crabs everywhere. You you would just have um, neighborhood gatherings where they'd have crab boils. They'd just get a giant table and just spread newspaper out over it. And everyone would just come out, bring their, their hammers and their crackers, and we'd all just get to it. I hope they have all those things because I need my hammer and everything. That, those things are hard to open. You need all your tools, but a, a real a real crab crab eater don't need nothing but their hands and maybe their teeth to get that meat out. But that's you. <laughs> yeah. We're going to do it. I'm going to show you how. I'm going to teach you again. Yes. Hopefully it'll, you'll, it'll stick this time. Yeah, I need another tutorial. <laughs> all right, we're going to get it. Ready for crabs. First crab of the summer. Now, you will learn how to open a Maryland blue crab. Yes, I know this is red, but when they pull these bad boys out the water, they are actually blue. No lie, Google it. So, Maryland blue crabs, really specific. It's a typical food to eat here. Easiest way to do it, you wanna start by pulling off the legs. If you pull them off right at the base, you might get a little bit of meat. Mmm, 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 pretty good. The legs aren't usually worth dealing with. The best I'll do is like snap them and try to pull them out. Sometimes you get stuff. It's a pretty good one. But, you mostly just pull these off. Eat the meat. Usually get the most on the back. That's the ones that they used to um, swim with. I'm dipping it in, well, they don't have Old Bay, but this is why Old Bay is so famous in Maryland. It's like a celery salt, but it's really salty. Really nice. You pull these legs off, then you got the claws. The claws, you get a lot of meat out of those. Two. Claws you don't want to mess too much with. Take your mallet, give them a good smack. Whoop. Pull out a lot of meat. Or if you don't want to, just give it a little bite. The shell's really brittle, easy to bite into. Now, let's get to where the real meat is. This bad boy right here. So this is the main body of it. You can tell these are jimmies, they're males because you see this uh, T shape on the bottom. But the way you open up jimmies, you want to treat them like a car hood. Flip it around the back and you want to reach right here Get your, your nails right in there. You can use a tool and just pop that bad boy right open. So this top, you can pretty much just toss this. It's got the face on it too. You don't want it staring at you while you eat it. Then you're left with this. These on the outside, those are the gills. Those help the, uh, the crab breathe, but inedible. Can't eat those. So pull them all off, toss them away. Now you got this kind of uh, body husk. You want to kind of squeeze it together. It'll collapse in on itself, it's hollow. And then it'll separate from the T, these are the genitalias, by the way, uh, into these two spaces. So in here, that's all your real good meat. Now, what some of you guys may be noticing is this uh, yellow, my dad likes to call it mustard. That's how you know you're getting a real Maryland blue crab. It's supposed to make it taste sweeter. I don't know. You can't clean it off, so you're gonna enjoy it. But, kind of reach your fingers right in there. 
pull out the white meat get you some butter get you some uh, Old Bay delicious beautiful thing and that's how you eat a Maryland blue crab yeah so in Puerto Rico we don't eat crab like this but um, I've learned since I moved here and with Ryan teaching me. He used to do all of this for me, but I'm gonna give it a try. <laughs> so I know you take the legs first and yeah. after that you have to pop the what? The hood? <laughs> yeah, pop the hood, you but remember. It's hard to do it with my I don't I think I I need some help <laughs> with Okay. Yeah, you got it. And then I have to take this off. It's kind of like you, but it tastes so good <laughs> that I don't mind. But I definitely not a fan of this part. Also, a lot of people say it's a lot of work, which it is to eat <laughs> to get to the meat. But I don't know. I love it. I think it's uh, it's. It tastes really good. I like doing this every summer. And, and I do use a lot of napkin. <laughs> Which I mean, uh, I just don't like eating with my hands for the most part. But this is like impossible not to. So. Did I finish? Did I just eat the meat now? Let's get the money shot. What is a money shot? The money shot is when you put the, uh, the meat into your mouth. Oh, that's a money shot? Yeah, you gotta get oh, that shit. big old lump. Okay, it was okay. Yeah, there you go. It's hard to. Need a little, little butter, a little bit of Old Bay. Oh! Mm, it's really good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>